I have a scene uh, the first time I meet uh, the character of Benicio, um, Alejandro. And uh, the first time I meet Alejandro, uh, I was very, of course, nervous about that scene because it's Benicio and it was the first time I, uh, you know, I was going to meet him. Um, but I was uh, excited about that scene that we have because it's uh, there's a lot of layers in there, you know, a lot of things because you don't know the for Gallo for the character of Gallo uh, how important this girl is. Her name is Isabella. Uh, she's great. I think um, you know just by looking at her, it, it, she has an energy of. Ah, uh, you know, bigger than life. Like, um, you know, she's a it's very, it's very special energy that she has, and she brings that to you know. You can see that in the camera. Um, she's an amazing actress. Like, she had like very in intense scenes where she had to be like you know devastated, and and you could really see her pain and you know crying right in the spot, and she came out like. Cut, and she was already like, eh, eh, eh. I'm like, how do you do that? <laughs> I think it's one of the greatest actors. Like, if it's me especially, he's one of those actors that I grew up, uh, you know, uh, admiring, and he's one, you know, one of those actors that made me do what I, what I do. So it was such a pleasure to work with him. Yeah, and he's, uh, he's so perfect. Like. I've learned so much from him, honestly. Like uh, I learned so much from him because he's he takes he's in everything, in every detail, you know, of 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 the acting. He's there, and um, it's just, he's so committed to the story. Being Mexican, it's a um, it's a very personal thing because this. Things do happen in Mexico, you know. It's not like for us; it's not fiction. Uh, so I think it's important that this tells a story in both sides, like you know uh, what what really happens, you know, like how the governments are involved and how the cartels are involved, and uh, you know everything from the from the from the ground. Um, so that I think it's important too that people see what the real, I mean, what's happening out there. I read the script and I love that it's like a new, it's, you know, it's a new thing. It's a, it's a, he has the life of his own, let's say. You know, it's a different, I mean, same characters, but different theme or different story. Um, so yeah, when I read it, I was so excited to be a part of it. And the look of it, I think, I think Sicario and this one, you know, the photography, it's just, it's going to be mind-blowing, yeah? Hey, Vali here. So, are you a big movie fan? Well, stay with me as I have some cool random facts for you. Due to a miscommunication on set in The Hateful Eight, Kurt Russell accidentally smashed an antique guitar from 1870 instead of a prop. The dog who played Toto in The Wizard of Oz received a higher salary than most of the people who played Munchkins. And lastly, Michael Caine was so terrified of Heath Ledger's Joker in The Dark Knight that he forgot his lines in the first scene they shot together. Do you know any other cool facts? Let me know below. And remember, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. Bye bye!